In this short video, I'm going to show off the Star Wars Darth Vader Black Series from Hasbro. The action figure comes complete with a lightsaber. I was wondering why they call it the Black Series, and the only answer I could find is because the packaging is black. Well, to be fair, that is a pretty good answer. So I do have a dilemma with these, and I am a grown-up, I'm a grown-up adult, and as a kid. I'd have ripped this thing out of the box and I'd have been playing with it in the back garden and having wonderful adventures and just just role-playing as if I was Darth Vader or if I had a Luke Skywalker figure. Then I would see battle and the play with toys. Play with toys. That's what kids should do and that's what kids did do back in my day. However, as an adult, we don't do that because obviously we don't play with toys because we're adults. You might play with toys, but usually not when other adults are around. But this video is to showcase this Hasbro figure. Now, there's only so much showcasing that I can actually do with it in the box. But as an adult, we have it instinctively burned into our brains now. So you can't take something out of its packaging. And I kind of get that. For me, I'm not one of these that thinks, oh, if I take this out of its packaging in 20 years, it won't be worth double the cost that it is now. For those of you who do wonder how much these Black Series figures cost, it's $24.99 for this. So ooh, in 20, 30 years, it might be worth 50. Well, possibly, but so, so what? <laughs> you know, it's, its figures should be made... And, and bought to enjoy. Um, so do I take this out of the box? Well, this is a product review video, so I kind of have to, and it just feels very, very strange to be able to, and I'm sure there's people watching this video that are pretty horrified that I'm actually taking the figure out of the box. Now, unfortunately, the packaging isn't the sort of packaging that you can uh, that you can put back on, unlike these little ships, which you can actually take out the box. So I am sacrificing the packaging just for you guys and girls. So they're well packaged. I'll give them that. Um, I am sacrificing it for you. Comes out like this. So as you can see, that is no use whatsoever now. It's fine. Adios packaging. There's a little leaflet in there. I'll have a look at that. I'm sure that's just a leaflet that says don't eat the figure. So now we have the figure. These are very well packaged. Very cool lightsaber there, which I can quite get close into. Let me just see how detailed I can show that. Hopefully the focus is working quite well. So we have that. Uh, if you're horrified by the fact I've just opened this and taken it out of the box, can you uh, let me know in a comment? So the tricky thing is how to get it out of the box. My partner, she does unboxing videos, and I'm sure... Hers are easier than this. There we go. Just I had I had a little bit of a rip there, and I'm like, oh my god, have I just ripped the cape? I haven't. So what we have here, it feels really good. It doesn't feel it. It's solid, but it also feels kind of bendy and poseable. So what we have here is it is fully posable. So you can move the hands. You can obviously move the arms. I'm actually really glad I took this out of the box so you can pose it. The head moves so you can do what you need to. Let's have a look at the legs. Bendable legs so at the knees. Bend up with the feet, even the feet move. So if you've got a bit of a strange desk, this is a really well-made figure, by the way. This is also a fabric, a fabric cloak. 
remember back in my day when I had the original, um, I believe they were the Kenner um, figures. They were they were the plastic cloaks, but if you look at the level of detail on Lord Vader, it is pretty impressive. I'm actually really glad I took this out of the package, and I'm sure some of you are still horrified. What we do, I don't know if he's a lefty or a righty, but let's try. Oh yes, I'm guessing he's a he's a lefty. Is you can take the figure. Actually, the legs go that way as well, so you do. It is fully posable, according to a, a description page that I saw. It's twenty nine different um, things you can move. So I'm going to try and stand him up now, and then what I'm going to do is move the camera for you. It isn't the easiest to stand up, I will give you that. Let me just lower this camera down a little bit, just so we can get a little bit of a better, a better view. What you used to have to do with some figures. There we go. Oh, and he fell over. I was so proud of that then, I thought he's he's done it. He has, he has stood up. Now he stood up. So what I'm gonna do is lower the camera down just so you can have a look at him. It wasn't the easiest to stand up, I will give it that. But I think once, yeah, it's me banging on the desk, he seems fine. So it's pretty stable once you, um, once you sort it out. But I think it looks pretty cool. And if, if you lot are horrified, that I've taken him out of the box, it's fine, because at least you've been able to have a look at how the figure works, what it feels like with the fabric cloak, and so you can uh, just thank me by liking the video, sharing the video, picking up one of these figures for yourself. There are quite a few amazing figures in the um, in the series, including a Stormtrooper, which for me is the iconic Star Wars figure. But it is pretty, it's a really well made figure. I mean, for $24.99, that does feel really, really cool um, and look really cool. And the detail is pretty impressive. So I may now be a fan of these Black Series Figures. Let me have a look. There's one thing I did forget to do, which was measure it for you, which is looks to be about seven, about seven inches, I guess, from feet to tip of head. And then when you compare it with some of the other ones, which I'm going to be doing a, a video of this one, that's that's very tiny, nice little Luke Skywalker there from the Book of Boba Fett. That's smaller. So I think if I'm going to go for Star Wars figures, I think these are definitely the ones. So well done, Hasbro. These are pretty cool. And you've now won me over to uh, to these. What do you think? Impressive? Most impressive. <laughs>